Hi guys and welcome to another video from prematchtrading.com A game between Ruben and Chelsea, Europa League Let me show you various uh, opportunities that arose within the game A little bit of scalping on the lower scores Got on the 0-0 uh, uh, nil -nil earlier on at 10.5 Soon as it was matched, got in the queue at uh, 10s To try and make a, a £300 on the 0-0 nil -nil. Looks meant to be a low scorer. A little play on the nil one as well. You can see a little bit of uh, the price came in. And this is what PMT has for the game. You can uh, hover your uh, mouse over the graphs and it will give you what, uh, what Betfair is showing on their graphs. You can see the unders have been coming in. But let's see what Sporty Index has for the game. Set it up, the top two, home supremacy, total goals, mid-price between the two. We go onto the manual page, it's uh, classified as a uh, international. And there's no clear favourite. When there is, we put a minus in for the home supremacy. And this is the prices we have on Sporting Index. We can see that the uh, unders are 1.8, higher than Betfair, but they have the 1-0 the same as Betfair. So what does that tell me? That tells me that the 1-0 is too high and it will come in. You can see there they have the draw a lot lower than Betfair too, which says to me that the draw will come in. And we're going to get on the 1-0 here. We're going to get on the 1-0 at the lay price. There's only £101 there. Better to get on at the lay price in general because if the price moves against you, then you can get out for scratch or at worst uh, a one tick loss. There's no money at 9.8. So we're going to get in there on the lay side, which you'll see uh, was a mistake in this uh, in this case. Wouldn't have been if I got matched at 10s, but you'll see this in, uh, in due course. Uh, it's best to get to the front of the queue because you'll get matched uh, a lot quicker. So no brainer stands to reason. Now Betfair has the over 3.5, uh, two ticks lower than uh, the PMT tool has. So what we're going to do is we're going to lay it at 4.4. Didn't want to miss the drift, so got in at the uh, on the current lay price here. Again, I'd normally uh, lay at the back price uh, and ask for a price because you will get taken more often than not. Just anticipating where the over 3.5 will go, getting in the queue. Uh, if unders come in, then overs will drift. That stands to reason. There's no money at 4.7, so let's be the first in the queue there. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of my bank has been used up here on the uh, on various trades as well as the um, the one mil lay, uh, and that is the downside of, of having your lay in. It does uh, eat into your bank. The draw inflation is low. When the di is low, then the draw should come in. Uh, when it's high, you can lay the draw and back the dog. One of those, if not both. So Sporty Index had it 3.32, another confirmation. And the more of these you have, the better. It forms an opinion of where a price will go. So we got in at uh, 3.45, 3.45, match straight away. So no point in hanging around. Let's just um, get in the queue at 3.4. There's um, about 8, eight grand, 8.3 grand ahead of us. So let's get in. This was emailed out to uh, PMT members so they could get on the same thing and make a, a few quid. And we do email out tips three to four times a week for various games. You can see Ruben's price is coming in. So that will help the 1-0. That will also bring the 1-0 price in.
to what can we do on the 2.5? Well, various things are saying that it's too high. SI, Pinnacle, uh, the draw inflation. Uh, you can see there it's been slowly creeping in. A slide, a, a little kink at the end there. So let's get in. Uh, Pinnacle have it at 1.71. They're usually pretty good to monitor where a price will go. Shout this tip up in the uh, PMT chat room so the guys can get on. Lots of good information and tips are given out there. And if you sign up, you should get yourself in there because you'll uh, you'll learn an awful lot about pre-match trading, which is a whole new world. There's no doubt about it. It's a whole new world. And one without the risk of a goal going into the wrong side. We're pretty unique out there. There aren't uh, many, if any, tools that I know that, um, that, that do this in play. So we're just going to scout in and out the 3.5, recycling the money, um, which is the way to go. You don't need a massive bank to use this tool. And you just uh, get in, get matched, and, and, and get out again. The draw has come in, as we as predicted, as advised. And what you can learn from just being in the chat room alone is um, well worth the subscription costs. Uh, it must be said that uh, on the video trades that the stakes that are used by uh, Adsta Emo professionals are, uh, are lower than what we normally use as professionals. Um, but we certainly don't want to scare the, uh, the living daylights out of newer traders when they see our screen with potential £2,000 red on it. So just uh, getting in and out, 3.5. JB's in again, JB, slow graffiti, fear. Um, many others really know their stuff. Um, SI have updated total goals. We've dropped that, so unders have come in. They now have the unders lower, which is good. And we're still working on the 3.5. Normally getting this sort of an hour, two hours before kickoff, uh, right up to kickoff. The 1-0 has come in. 1-0 has come in because Rubin have come in. Hundreds have dropped. Um, I also posted this over at um, tradingfootball.eu, uh, sister site. And we can see we're getting close to kickoff now, so uh, it's time to get out. Don't take the, 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 the trades in play, although I did. For about 20 30 seconds here but as a rule it's not advised you'll uh, you'll, you'll get burnt you'll lose money um, and it's, uh, it's it's just not worth it it's just not worth it and um, uh, there are many misalignments on games uh, every day of the week uh, and even when there are not misalignments, uh, and PMT is saying the price is the same as Betfair, then we can we can get in on that as well. We can back at the lay and lay at the back price. The tick gain. So just trying to get out at 4.8 here for a free uh, 90 odd pounds profit if the game ends over 3.5. No bugger wants to take it. Which is unfortunate and it's gone in play so ignore what I said earlier <laughs> joke no, you need to get out as soon as possible and never like uh, letting something go in play um, a goal in the first sort of 30 seconds and um, you know, I would have been in deep trouble here but yeah, I had, uh, submitted as soon as possible 
just to just to get out and there we go uh, 90 odd would have been better but uh, we'll, we'll we'll live with this we'll accept that and now we're in a, in a in a strong position the idea was to back Rubin who I fancy to win this um, lay under 1.5 Got one nil covered, nil nil covered, nil one covered. But the goal came so early that uh, the 1.5 wasn't matched. So I decided instead to uh, do it on the 2.5, uh, which was uh, matched. So all the profits were on over 2.5. took some of the green off the uh, 3.5 so that covered the as good as the 2.5 loss we've got the nil one covered we've got uh, Rubin covered so a fairly low risk trade here And if you can build up free money via the PMT tool, then you will have a very low risk um, uh, trade if you choose to take it in play, which uh, I do a, a fair bit of the time because I own more that way. Here we go, 2-2. Two, two. Adjusting the position, little lay on the draw. There will be another goal. And suspended, a penalty to Rubin. Excellent. Well, hey, get in. So now I'm back on Rubin. It's looking good. Green that up. Cheeky little uh, back on Chelsea in case they come back. Lay the 3 2. Still fancy another goal here. Did actually finish 3 2, picked up 77 pounds, and uh, a nice little uh, game traded there. And this tool isn't difficult. Um, the ones that uh, subscribe and stick with it do very well from it. This is another game, this is the Newcastle game. You can clearly see that the 1 0 is, uh, is too high. So a simple back of 15s, matched lay at 14.5. And some pick it up straight away, some take to it like a duck to water. Others that stick with it do very well, the rewards are there. Like anything in life, you uh, get out of it what you put in. Uh, and, and sometimes you do have to work for something. You know, but as I say, the ones that uh, have stuck with it are uh, certainly rewarded. Big City is very good. It's been reviewed by four or five of the big boys. The reviews can be found on our website, prematchtrading.com. Independent reviews, have a read of those. You can see how good it actually is. So £117, happy days. We'll see you again soon.